Welcome back. Michigan State University is using high-speed train technology to detect airborne viruses. And the state hopes to lead the country in good-paying jobs and innovative industries. Keir Lake has that and more in this week's Tech Tuesday. University of British Columbia and Michigan State University researchers invented a purification system that quickly and inexpensively detects airborne viruses. Using a technique known as magnetic levitation, the team can easily collect and concentrate viruses from the air to help prevent future outbreaks of respiratory disease. And this technology is the same that enables high-speed trains. One of the researchers says this could help identify a contaminated environment before a pandemic happens. Air samples can be collected from places like doctor's offices and airports. Michigan innovators are now looking to secure federal funding from the Bipartisan Chips and Science Act to become a federal tech hub. The Chips Act will invest $10 billion over five years in 20 regional technology and innovation hubs in five Michigan regions have submitted applications. And one of those regions is here in Lansing. The MSU Foundation's Materials Advancement and Research Hub and innovators are hoping to have a nationwide impact on the country's ability to utilize advanced materials ranging from semiconductors to healthcare. If you're on Threads, you will finally be able to use the social media platform without an app. Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg says a web version of the app will be rolling out over the next few days, and the move will allow the platform, dubbed the Twitter killer, to better compete with the Elon Musk platform, which is now called X. A Meta spokesperson said in a statement, this new experience will let users post, view their feeds, and interact with other posts from their desktops. Here for you in Lansing, Kira Lake, 6 News.